Assalamualaikum and a very good day to you all. Uh, in this video, I would like to show you how to find uh, determinant of a 3 by 3 matrix by expanding the cofactor along the second column. Now, it's easier for us to circle where the second column is. So, where? Oh, here. Okay, so the second column is this one. And the elements are 1, 0, and 2. Okay, so I just get rid of the circles first. Now, so, the first step is that we notice where the second column. Okay, so in this case here, we do here, yeah. Okay, in the question, we get it. Okay, good. Now, and the next step is that we, uh, since uh, we draw the column here also, okay, we write the sign, the cofactor sign. Okay, since the second column, okay, starts with a negative the the apa the the top term at the top element the the middle one is uh, plus and the bottom one is minus ah uh, negative okay and then we need to transfer the the sign the element and the minor eh? so we transfer all these over here the apa the sign so the first cofactor sign is negative and then positive and then negative okay and then we copy the element where to get the element easy here okay so the element is one the first one lah the first negative one is, uh, the first one is the sign is negative and the element is one after we get we write the element we need to write the minor Okay, what is the minor? The minor is when we delete the first row, uh, sorry, the first row, yes, and then the second column. So, what's left is the number that we haven't crossed with the purple line. So, it's um, 4, 1, 1, 3. Okay. So, we've done with the second one. Now, the third one is the uh, the element. Okay, the element and the minor. The element is, uh, you straight, huh? the element is zero. Okay, so zero. And then, what is the uh, minor? Uh, we put a line crossing the element okay since zero is on the second row and the second column so i already crossed them out now the and then we take out the number that we haven't crossed with the purple line so what's left is two minus three one three okay yeah that's it or maybe i use this one as with orange this is orange or red or red zero okay we continue with the last one. Okay. Now. Okay, get it off. Get it off. Okay. Now the element, the last element is 2. So 2 over here. Okay. And then we get the, cross them with lines. Crossing the element that we circled just now. Okay. And then we write what's left. What's left is 2 minus 3, 4 and 1. Hmm. Sorry, made a mistake. 4 and 1. Hmm, correct. Okay. And then, uh, from there, we can continue lah. Okay. So, this one, minus 1. And then, 12, minus 1. And then, plus 0. Since 0 multiply anything is 0, so no need to proceed lah. Because, waste of time. Huh? Okay. Minus 2. Bracket is 2 minus minus 12. Correct. Correct. Okay. Now, that one is minus 11 plus 0 minus 2. Berapa tu? Plus 14. 14. So, minus 11 minus 28. So, it's minus 39. Okay. So, that's the answer. Now, what I want to show you is that no matter 
the value of determinant is always the same no matter which column or which row that you expand the cofactor to okay in this example we expand the factor uh, the cofactor along the second column right uh, now let's see the example that we did previously uh, by expanding the same matrix by expanding the cofactor along the first row you see when we do the first row the arrange the number arrangement is a little bit different okay but at the end we get the same value which is 39 you see over here 39 this one also we get minus 39 okay that's all thank you for your time and attention maybe i just uh, zoom it this out for you to see the whole picture and then maybe you can take a screenshot of it Okay, thank you for your time and attention. Assalamualaikum and have a good day.